It's Tuesday and it's the second vlog of Vlogist. So I debated for a while, should I talk about Lord of the Rings or cats or the weather or the moon as a theme for Vlogist? But then I finally picked a theme, Britain. First, in response to Sheila's question, she wanted me to talk about Brett and Brett news. Um, I don't know anything, but let's talk about Britain. I'm going to see Harry Potter again with my parents this evening. They're going because they haven't seen it yet, and I have not seen it in two weeks. <laughs> and I saw Moon the other day, and that was by David Bowie's son. British. And who doesn't love David Bowie, am I right? David Bowie's like the greatest person in the world. There are also plenty of other people that I love from Britain, such as the Beatles, the Who, the Mighty Boosh. So there's all sorts of British people, and <laughs> duh, there's all sorts of British people in the world. But yeah, so that's going to be my theme, and it doesn't mean I'm going to wear this shirt every day, because that's gross, but I'm going to talk about British things each and every day, so be prepared. Coming off of my new theme, um, yesterday I watched the rest of season two of The Mighty Boosh, and then I had such a thirst for more that I pulled out season three and I watched the outtakes, the publicity, the making of, I pretty much watched all of the um, special features besides the commentary because I don't want to watch commentary before I've seen the episodes. I usually save the commentary for later, <laughs> Because once you've seen the episode 8,000 times, um, 8, 8 5,000 times is what I was about to say. Does that make any sense? Um, but once you've seen an episode a whole bunch of times, then it's time for the commentary. Because you know the episode well enough that it's not going to distract you. Because I've tried before, I think I did it with the monkeys actually. Which, by the way, there's one British member. Can you name him? <laughs> but, um... With the monkeys, I watched each episode, and then I watched each episode with commentary, but I didn't know the episodes well enough, so I was getting a little distracted paying attention to the episode and not really listening to what Mike Nesmith had to say, so I had to watch the commentary over and over again, and now I've memorized the monkeys' commentary. I've had those DVDs since the beginning of senior year of high school, so it's been a while. But yeah, I'm loving The Mighty Boosh. It, it brightens my day, especially when it's a dark day because there's no sun. If I sit there and watch all of it, you should see me. I walk around like a crazy drunk person. The story of how I discovered the Mighty Boosh is kind of funny. I was, of course, way behind everybody else. I had not seen the show until this spring. <laughs> yeah, um, the big fat quiz of the year. And I just, I thought at first, oh my god, Russell is hilarious. And then I realized the guy he's with is really cute too. Noel is really cute. He's like a puppy or a small child, especially when he is eating the bananas in the one and he loses his stylus and some of the comments he makes and pieces of rainbow and stuff like that. Um, so I just kind of fell in love with him through that. And Jermaine Clement from Flight of the Concords posted a vlog or a blog about the Mighty Boosh recommending it to his fans and he posted the old Greg episode. But like an idiot, I didn't watch it. I just commented on how boosh makes me think of the sound when people punch you in the face. Boosh. Kathy told me, she started quoting Old Greg to me, but I didn't know it was Old Greg at the time. She, she started quoting, have you ever drunk Baileys from a shoe and stuff like that. And um, she said, oh, I, I kept asking her, what is that? Why do you keep quoting that? And she said, oh, it's just this silly thing online. Um, and she said, I think they're from New Zealand, actually. And I was like, no, if they were from New Zealand, I would know about them. But I looked them up on YouTube, and I found old Greg, and I realized, holy crap, that's the Mighty Boosh, because I had seen pictures, because Jermaine posted stuff. So, and then I actually watched old Greg. Didn't actually understand it. I was very, very confused, because that's kind of a weird thing to stumble upon when you've not seen the show yet. But then from there, I started looking up clips of... Vincent Howard and then and then I fell in love because the more you watch the more you love so that's the more you know and that's everything I got so until Thursday this is Tuesday British but Keshi says hi <laughs>